welcome. Welcome if you are new here and welcome back if you've been with me for a while. I really do appreciate you all. Today I have for you fashion. So as you can see, the box is opened. This intro is being recorded after I had unboxed it, uh, just because it was easier for me to do it that way. Uh, I was doing clothing subscriptions and I was just trying to get them on and try on. Uh, there is a disclaimer on this box. A couple of disclaimers, I guess. For some reason in my profile, it stated that I wore mediums. I'm not sure how that got that way. Uh, this is the second time I am trying fashion. The boxes that I will be getting from Fashion are sent to me for review for you guys. But this is my second go round with Fashion. I'm not entirely sure why my profile said medium. Generally, I'm a size four. Sometimes I have to size up to a medium if the material doesn't have any stretch in it. This first box or the first box in this series of three boxes the fit was off and that was my fault. So that's the first disclaimer. The second one is this box is being sent to me for review. The three consecutive boxes back to back just because that's kind of the way I like to do my box subscriptions or my clothing styling services. I will say that I have done this for fashion before and I actually like their service. I like the way they operate. If I were to take two of my favorite clothing styling services, which is Trunk Club and Stitch Fix, and I took the best parts of both of those boxes, I would put them into fashion. Just the ease of communicating with a stylist or the representative. I just feel like it's a very easy company to communicate with. Say, I'm going to give you a couple of details. details. Down below, there will be linked a playlist. In the very first video I did, there is a slew of information about this, but you email them or you go on to your profile and you just say, hey, I want a box. Like they don't send it to you reoccurringly without your permission. They do send you a preview of your clothing items. They send you around seven items and uh, you choose from the seven items the five that you want or you can completely ignore the email if you choose uh, if you prefer surprises and then your stylist will just pick the five all of the products are cruelty and uh, cruelty free and vegan your first styling session is always free and then after that you get charged a 15 dollar styling fee but it is applied to whatever you purchase. The only, re the only way that you would lose out on that $15 is if you didn't buy anything from your box. They do offer video calls. Uh, it says to all of their clients, so that's cool because the last time I did fashion, they only gave it to select clients, so I think that's really cool that they widened that scope a little bit. A dollar from every box goes to Second Chance Rescue in New York City. And you get $10 toward uh, your first styling box. So I thought that that was kind of cool. And also just one more talking point because I think that this is exceptional. I don't know of any box that does this. If you keep three or four pieces, they give you a 25% discount. And if you keep all five pieces that you're sent, you get a 30% discount. I have been doing clothing boxes for years and I don't think I have ever heard of one that gives that good of a discount. Like Stitch Fix, if you keep all five, you get 25% uh, off. Uh, with Trunk Club, I think if you keep the whole box, which is insane nobody ever does that i think you get like an additional 15 percent off but so from a consumer's point of view i think that that is an excellent incentive as far as keeping pieces from your box you do get to keep your box for three days try on everything and then you send everything back it does come with a uh, bag with a return shipping label so you just everything you don't keep you just put back in that bag and you stick it back in the mail what's next and it just kind of tells you what to expect so there you go you can pause that on there if you'd like you also get an invoice with a note from your stylist so i will pin that up somewhere 
in here. Like I said, there will be a playlist below and that first video has a lot, a lot, a lot of information in it. So if you would like more information, you can go check that out. But let's get into the box. <laughs> first, we have the leopard print wrap dress with ruffles and a medium and a jewel green for $56 by Gilly. I think that this dress is really, really cute. Unfortunately, it is a type of material that doesn't stretch much, so it is just too tight across my bust area. It's unfortunate because I am a little top heavy and I do have issues with things fitting across my bust. There is a button here that I cannot get to stay buttoned because I'm too big across the bust, but it is what it is. Unfortunately, this is a no. We have a faux suede dress with embroidery and a medium and a black by Skyzer Blue for $48. So unfortunately this dress is just too big. I would need to size down to a small in it. There's just way too much room and the way it cascades off of my bust line, it just makes me look bigger than I am. So unfortunately this dress is going to be a no. I do want to say I don't typically like floral prints, but this dress isn't that bad. So I don't mind this this floral print. Unfortunately, it's just too big. <laughs> Next, we have uh, the Skies Are Blue dress with pearl necklace and a medium in the color red for $42. Unfortunately, this dress is just too large for me too. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to check my sizes and my profile. Um, I'm pretty sure it stated that I wear a small most times and so I don't know it's just it's too large in the neck area the way it falls off of my bust it just makes me look bigger than I am and then obviously it's just it's just too big in the neck area I do like the pearl detail and I actually don't mind these sleeves that billow out like this um, but unfortunately this is a no because it's too big Next, we have a floral shift dress by Esquisse Paris in a medium for $40. I actually like the way this dress fits, and I, when I got my preview of this dress, I wasn't sure about it, but I thought that I would give it a try. And unfortunately, it's just a little too much floral for me all over. Mm, and it's a little too buttoned up too, you know, like the high neckline. It's just not really my thing. I love the colors. I'm just not into all the floral. Unfortunately, this dress will be a no. Last but not least, we have a Zion wrap blouse in a size small in snow orchid. Oh wait, I'm confused. It says it's a size small, but then it also says it's a size medium. So I'm not entirely sure what that means. The brand is Naked Zebra and it's $42. Unfortunately, this is just too large. I actually think that this would be okay for like roaming around the house and being comfortable. It is very, very soft and very comfortable. Unfortunately, I would much rather just wear a t-shirt around the house or a beater around the house. So this isn't really my style for lounging, I guess, and um, it's definitely not my style for going out in. I think, I mean, I love the color. I just, um, it's just too big. <laughs> and I'm not really sure how I feel about this a twisty thing that's going on in the front. So unfortunately, this shirt is a no. So unfortunately, everything in this fashion is going to be a no this time around. I'm going to have to speak with my stylist, check my profile for my sizes, because, you know, that could have been totally on me. I may have put medium in my sizes. I'm not entirely sure. I'll have to speak with, anyway, everything was too big, except for the one dress that had just too much floral on it. But I am looking forward to my next fashion and uh, speaking with my stylist, just to kind of see if we can get the sizes right. But I mean, I, I, do, I do like fashion. I just don't understand why they sent me all mediums. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to talk to my stylist. Anyway, that is it. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. I enjoyed trying everything on. It's just, unfortunately, everything was too big. So, that's it. Have a great day. Bye.